Welcome to Whack All Access. I'm Rachel Vigil. Today we welcome in Steve Schaefer, the head coach for swimming and diving at Grand Canyon. Coach was awarded Coach of the Year last year on the men's side and brought GCU their first WAC championship. Coach, how do you keep the expectations so high for the men's team? Oh, I, I, I think the guys uh, have that expectation for themselves and the women are, are wanting to get there in their time. And uh, I think the kids do a pretty good job of keeping it in front of themselves, but we, we, we'll prod them and remind them occasionally if things kind of fall off. Is there any pressure to obtain that same goal? No, I, I think it's probably hard to repeat. So we're just talking about that it's definitely a challenge and certainly not a given. And uh, on the men's side, the conference is setting up to be a four or five team race where anybody can win. It's really, really tight this year. And you guys just came back from the U.S. Open. How was Atlanta? Atlanta was good. It was a very big, fast meet. Uh, a lot of swimmers from all over the world trying to see where they're at uh, kind of midway through their preparations for making their Olympic teams or competing at the Olympics and everybody trying, U.S. kids trying to make trials. And we were kind of hanging on, on after our Purdue midseason rest and, and seeing what we could do and what we could put up. And then we took our, we got the two Russian guys training post-grad with us and we took them there to see where they're at. And all in all, not a bad showing for us. We, we enjoyed the competition. One of those Russian guys being Mark Nikolaev, three-time WAC Swimmer of the Year there. How did he do in the meet? Um, Mark's main event is the 100 backstroke, and he finished sixth in the 100 backstroke, making the A final there. Did really well. Time uh, in 54, as best as a 53 high, so we were pretty pleased with that time. We're not, we need to get him a little bit faster yet, but uh, we've got till April, till, till his trials or whatever they figure out to do for selection in Russia. Um, and then we were testing out the 100 freestyle. We've got some work to do there to see if we can't get them on a relay. And, and then uh, uh, all in all, those other events turned out pretty well. You mentioned a little bit about the women's team. Last year, they finished seventh in the WAC championships, but they've already won a couple of big dual meets this year, New Mexico State, Seattle U. How do you keep that optimism alive for that team to hopefully win a WAC championship this year? Well, I'm, I, I, they told me very frankly that they don't like being told they can't win meets, so I start telling them they can win meets, uh, <laughs> whether I necessarily believe it or not. And they've actually proven me wrong a couple of occasions uh, this season. And I just tell them, you know, that, that we set our goals. It's the whack, the women's, you know, race looks uh, a little open this year. New Mexico State had a really good showing against NAU, and so. The, you know, they're going to be really good. I think we can certainly move up. I, I, I've told them, let's let's see what we can do to contend, and, and we'll see how it goes. Your next meet is January 11th against BYU. That's almost a full month away. How do you keep that competition mindset in when there's so much time in between meets? Oh, well, uh, we just get back to hard work, and then we do we find ways to build racing into practice and hold them to standards. And we did, a, we did a little bit of really fast swimming, getting up and standing up and swimming fast in practice today, even though finals are going on. We had still, you know, the kids that were there did a good job, and we'll just keep doing that, working hard through the break, uh, give them a week off, and then we're back at it. Perfect, Coach. We, we really appreciate your time and look forward to seeing you in Houston in a few months. Looking forward to it. Thank you, Rachel. Thank you. Steve Schaefer from GCU Swimming and Diving. For Whack All Access, I'm Rachel Vigil.